women journalists have a significant role to play in addressing the impacts of climate change and other environmental issues in Ghana. Issues such as plastic waste pollution, forest degradation, water pollution, illegal logging and mining, are some of the leading environmental challenges in Ghana. With support from the French Embassy in Ghana through the Juabor Small Grants Project, R.O. Shah Ghana, provided training for 23 journalists in climate change and environmental reporting, advocacy and policy influencing. The training brought together journalists from the Upper West Region, Savannah, Northern, Ashanti, Eastern, Western, Central and the Greater Accra Region. The three-day training included fact-checking environmental stories, story development, knowledge on Ghana's forests and environmental policies, gender equity and a practical field visit to experience at first hand some environmental challenges. My name is Patricia Mabosu and I write for Ep Giant Broadcasting in Kumasi, the Ashanti Regional Capital. I'd like to say thank you so much to the French Embassy in Ghana and also to Arosha Ghana for building the capacity of female journalists across the country in these past three days. And of course, for officially also launching the Drabble 2020 project. As female journalists, our voice really matters when it comes to environmental degradation, when it comes to um, conservation issues, when it comes to accurate reportage on things happening around us in our community. This workshop is teaching us that for journalists to report accurately, it's imperative for us to do critical analysis of environmental issues, fact check every little detail we get in order to report. You don't just hear anything, then you give it out. My name is Inathalia Kwansa, the Western Regional Correspondent for Joy News, and then the Komlad most promising young journalist in Ghana at the moment. Um, I work in the resource and dark region and then this workshop organized by Arocha Ghana for 25 women journalists in the country is an eye opener. It's one that uh, is helping us to understand the environment very well. Going back to the region to do my reportage, uh, this workshop is an opportunity for me to report accurately, it's an opportunity for me to do fact checking, it's an opportunity and it has also empowered me to have a taste or to have a feel when it comes to the environment.